ಶ್ರೀಮಾನ್ ವೆಂಕಟನಾಥಾರ್ಯ ಕವಿತಾರ್ಕೇಶರಿ ವೇದಾಂತಾಚಾರ್ಯವ್ಯೋಮೇ ಸನ್ನಿಭರ್ತ ಸದಾಹುತಿ ಜ್ಞಾನಾನಂದಮಯ ದೇವಂ ನಿರ್ಮಲಸ್ಫಟಿಕಾಕೃತಿ ಆಧಾರಂ ಸರ್ವಿಜ್ಞಾನಯಗ್ರೀವಾಸ್ಮೆ ವಂದೇ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀಹಯಗ್ರೀವಂ ಪುರೋ ಮೇ ಮಾರ್ಗದರ್ಶಕಂ ಯೇನಾಪಕ್ವಮತಿರ್ನೂನಂ ಕಿಂಚಿತ್ ಭೂತ ಸಂಸ್ಕೃತ ಅಚ್ಯುತ ಸಂಪ್ರದಾಯನ್ ಮಾಂ ಚ್ಯುತ ಮುಕುಂದ ಮೇ ಗುರು ಅರಕ್ಷತನುಗಂಪಾತೆ ಪದಮನುಸರಾಮ್ಯಹಂ ಪದ್ಮನಾಭ ಗುರು ಮಂದೇ ಸದಾಚಾರ್ಯಂ ಅಹಂ ಸದಾ ಕುಲೀನಂ ಧೀ ಸುಶೀಲಾದಿ ವಿಗ್ರಹಂ ಶುದ್ಧ ವೇದಿಕ ವೇದಾಂತಲಕ್ಷ್ಮಣ ಮುನೀಂದ್ರಕೃಪಾತಮೋಧಂ ದತ್ತಾಧಯುಗ್ಮಸರಶೀರ್ಘಂಕರಾಜಂ ತಯ್ಯಂತಯುಗ್ಮಕೃತಭೂರಿಪರಿಶ್ರಮಂತ ಶ್ರೀರಂಗಲಕ್ಷ್ಮಣಮುನಿಂ ಶರಣಂ ಪ್ರಪದ್ಯೇ ಶ್ರೀಮತ್ ವೇದಾಂತರಾಮಾನುಜೇಟಿ ಕೃಪಯಾ ರಂಜನಿನ್ಯಸ್ತಾರಂ ದತ್ತಂ ಪ್ರಾಪ್ತಾಗಮಾಂತೃತೆ ಮನಗಣಂ ಶಿಷ್ಟತಾ ಪೂರ್ಣಮಗ್ರಿಯ ಶ್ರೇಷ್ಠ ಶ್ರೀರಂಗರಾಮಾನುಜ ಮುನಿಗರುಣಾಲಬ್ಧಮೋಕ್ಷಾಶ್ರಮಂ ತಂ ಸತ್ವಸ್ಥಂ ಶ್ರೀವರಾಹಂ ಯತಿವರ ಮನಘಂ ದೇಶಿಕಂ ಸಂಶಯಾಮಿ ಅಸ್ಮದ್ ಗುರುಪರಂಪರಾಯ ನಮಃ ಧ್ವೇ ಕರಕ್ಷ್ಯ ಮಮ ತ್ವೇವ ಕರುಣಾಕರ ನ ಪ್ರವರ್ತಯ ಪಾಪಿ ಪ್ರವೃತ್ತ ನಿವರ್ತಯ ತ್ವೇಕರಕ್ಷ್ಯ ಮಮ ತ್ವೇವ ಕರುಣಾಕರ ನ ಪ್ರವರ್ತಯ ಪಾಪಿ ಪ್ರವೃತ್ತ ನಿವರ್ತಯ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಏಟ್ ವರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಶ್ರೀ ನ್ಯಾಸದಶಕ ಕಂಪೋಸ್ಟ್ ಬೈ ಕವಿತಾರ್ಕಿಗ ಸಿಂಹ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ವೇದಾಂತ ದೇಶಿಕ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಆರ್ ದಿ ಬಿನ್ ಲುಕಿಂಗ್ ಅಟ್ ದ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ನ್ಯಾಸದರ್ಶಕ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಎ a decade or um, a set of 10 poems on the concept of nyasa or bharanyasa in the previous verse mam madhyam chinnikilam we saw how we have to consider all our possessions to be mere instruments while performing kainkarya to shriyapati to bhagavan and bhagavatas in the villages the agricultural fields are given on some conditions to the farmers to plow and uh, to cultivate crops when harvesting is done they have to give a share to the person who owns the land i mean the farmer does not own the land the owner of the land does not wish to do or does not have time to do agriculture by himself. So what he does is, he gives the land for the sake of cultivation to a farmer who makes use of the land, does agriculture, but upon harvest he has to give a share to the landlord or do as he directs. In the same way, all that is given to us could be the building, could be the people that we are related to. All these things are possessions of Bhagavan. He has given them to us for the sake of rendering Kainkarya to Bhagavan. This should be our Bhava. At the same time, while we render the Kainkarya by making use of these possessions, we also get to enjoy them, thereby satisfying the needs, the simple needs which we may have. in this way what happens is that our ahankara mamakara they gradually they uh, gradually they become weakened they they are, they are weakened by this and then eventually at the time of moksha will be free from them completely a prapanna if there is a person who has done prapatti with the right knowledge true an acharya must not perform any sin because we why do we commit these sins papa why because out of agnana out of agnana we commit sins but now prapanna she has got the right jnana isn't it she has realized that he is dasa bhuta to bhagavan only when we act on our own will for our own sake to fulfill the needs of the body and let us say the mind we tend to commit papa but now the prapanna falls in line with the command of the bhagavan so there is literally no scope for him to make mistakes 
but this is ideal state as we said in the one of the previous recordings the moment the prapatti is done all the sanchita karma and the agami karma they do not hang on they do not cling on to the prapatti even the prarabdha karma is reduced to such an extent that it lasts until the fall of this body but nevertheless there is something which is left and that could be potent enough to to force us to nudge us to commit sins so the the ability to perform a wrong deed a misdeed is always in us that potential is always in us until we get liberated and until we leave this body permanently so what should we do we don't have any other resort except bhagavan so again let us make a prayer to him by repeating this verse vadeka rakshyasya mama tvameva karunakara na pravartiya paapani pravartani nivartaya vadeka rakshyasya we may tend to read it as rakshasya but rakshyasya rakshya means one who needs to be protected rakshyasya means of the person or to that person who is that person mama the person who actually recites this verse <coughs> karunakara karunakara is a sambodhana pada the vocative term karunakara karuna means daya the foremost quality in bhagavan which attracts the devotee and also which does all good to the to the bhakta or to the prapanna swami deshika has extolled daya or karuna by singing in praise of it in 108 verses and that and that work is called as daya shataka daya shatakam one particular verse explains the the importance of daya it is the 17th verse achidavishishtan pralaye jantu navalokya jata nirveda karana kalebara yogam vitarasi vishasaira natha karune tvam it answers a very important uh, question why does the brahman or bhagavan create why does he do or why does he uh, create the world we may think perhaps god is not fair in creating this world in an uneven fashion there is lot of disparity here lot of discrimination lot of difference here so bhagavan is a kind of unfair and he is less compassionate we may tend to think so but swami deshika says it's actually the compassion of bhagavan which as the compassion what it does it prompts bhagavan please do the creation compassion or daya is personified as a devi to bhagavan as a divine consort so that divine consort what what does she do she nudges bhagavan come on it's time to create now why should bhagavan create now so says swami deshika achida vishishtan pralaye jantu navalokya jata nirveda at the time of delusion or pralaya it is said that the atmas the chetana principles what they do is they devoid of all the gross bodies so they don't have any means to expand their consciousness their consciousness is in fact at the lowest level possible so they have become one with the matter in such a way that it becomes it becomes difficult to differentiate and say this is chetana and that is achetana achit abhishtan which means they have become almost one with achit pralaye during the delusion jantu navalokya looking at all the beings jata nirveda daya devi becomes very worried because how long can the jeevatmas be like this should they not get an opportunity to 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 gain the right knowledge to get to get the right body first of all and then through that body they have to gain right knowledge and then do perform an upaya prapatti and and uh, attain bhagavan so shouldn't be shouldn't they be given any chance if this this going to extend i cannot bear looking at them in this way any mother would like her child to get up and uh, play you know so the child has to uh, play and enjoy its uh, uh, life so 
సో దయాది వాట్ వాట్ డస్ ఇడు కరుణ కలేబర యోగం వితరసి విషశైలు నాథ కరుణేత్వం సో వాట్ షీ డస్ షీ ప్రామిస్ భగవాన్ టు స్టార్ట్ క్రియేషన్ సో దట్ ద బీయింగ్స్ ద గెట్ ద కరుణ కలేబర యోగ ది గెట్ ఆల్ ది సెన్స్ ఆర్గన్స్ ద బాడీ సో దట్ ద గెన్ అప్టైన్ ది రైట్ నాలెడ్జ్ అబౌట్ భగవాన్ సో స్వామి దేశిగా షీస్ కరుణాకర కరుణాకర మీన్స్ ది వెరీ అబౌట్ ఆఫ్ కరుణ ఆర్ మర్సి రక్ష్య మమ నివర్తయ నివర్తయ మీన్స్ రెఫ్రైన్ ఆర్ మేక్ మీ రెఫ్రైన్ ప్రివెంట్ మీ ఆర్ ప్రివెంట్ ప్రివెంట్ మీ ఫ్రమ్ వాట్ పాపాని పాపాని నివర్తయ ఐ హ్యావ్ బీన్ ఆర్ అదర్ ఐ హ్యావ్ డన్ లాడ్ ఆఫ్ సింపుల్ యాక్టివిటీస్ పాప కర్మ సో ఐ హ్యావ్ దిస్ టెండెన్సీ టు రిపీట్ దమ్ సో ప్రివెంట్ మీ న ప్రవర్తయ్య పాపాని న ప్రవర్తయ్య డోంట్ గివ్ ది ఆపర్చునిటీ సో ఈ వాట్ హ్యాపన్స్ ఇస్ అడి ఎన్ థింగ్స్ లైక్ దిస్ ఇఫ్ యూ టేక్ దర్ హండ్రెడ్ పీపుల్ ఇన్ ద వర్ల్డ్ లెట్ ఎస్ ఏ నైంటీ పీపుల్ ఆర్ లైక్ వెన్ దే గెట్ అన్ ఆపర్చునిటీ దే మేక్ ఎ మిస్టేక్ వెన్ దే గెట్ అన్ ఆపర్చునిటీ దే మేక్ ఎ మిస్టేక్ గివెన్ అ టెంప్టేషన్ దే విల్ Uh, they will do a mistake there are five people who are the opposite even when they are getting an opportunity to commit a mistake they won't do they are not tempted at all right so 95 is gone the balance five to which adin belongs is making an opportunity to create to commit a mistake making an opportunity creating an opportunity to make a mistake to that group adin belongs to now people like us people like adian should tell bhagavan papani na pravartaya please stop me from doing such things pravartana nivartaya there could be something which i have been doing already so please pull me out of that don't give me that mindset to repeat those mistakes why tvameva you want you have to do this i cannot do because i want to possess i possess a wealth called as akinchanyam elsewhere swami deshikan says akinchanyam is the only wealth that the prapanna has that ela mai as we say in tamil the inability is the biggest wealth the prapanna possesses a mother rushes to that child which cannot take care of itself right whereas she would be a little let us say patient with a child which can do things which can take care of things by itself but for example there's an infant a month old then the mother rushes because it cannot be on its own why because it is not able so a prapanna only because of his inability he has projected his inability before bhagavan and then said i cannot take up any other means or in i cannot take up bhakti yoga i desire moksha but you have to only give me. so that's why bhagavan deshika says tvadeka rakshyasya mama to me who am i what kind of a person i am a person one has one who has to be protected by you only tvatu eka tvadeka tvadeka means by only you only by you only rakshyasya mama adiyenukku as we say in tamil to me who am i one who has to be protected by you only tvameva you alone i can i won't resort to any other devata i i will not have sambandha with any other devata i don't have any enmity with them but i i won't go and seek anything from them therefore papaani na pravartaya please do not put me into that situation in which i'll be tempted and i'll commit a sin namavar the yogi ayvar who spent his time in that uh, uh, tiny hole in the in the, in the stem of a, a tamarind tree who does not or who did not get into the samsara itself yet he praised to bhagavan in the seventh pat this is ayam pat the 100 shlokas and the pasurams unnilavi aivaral komedeetri ennai un paada pankayam goes that begin to verse he says bhagavan i cannot rather i fail every day because of the 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 indriyas and mind they very strong those five fellows namely the sense organs what they do 
in the battle with them daily i lose i lose every day so only you have to make them weaker you have to make me stronger so that i kind of win over them and then i uh, be always in your memories or rather i have you in my memory or smriti or dhyana if namavar is going to sing like this what needs to be told about people like adiyen and maybe a few of the listeners so tvadeka rakshasya mama tvameva karuna kara na pravartiya paapani pravartana nivartiya so bhagavan e karuna kara please show mercy upon me you have to protect me you have to prevent me from the sinful activities which adiyen has the expertise ahamasmya paradh chakravarti se swamireshika elsewhere so i that chakravarti that that uh, emperor i am an emperor you have to imprison me otherwise if if i am let free what i will do i will only make mistakes pravrittani nivartha ye pravrittani means which have been already begun and being done on a daily basis please prevent me i cannot prevent myself so please prevent me from uh, repeating those mistakes and also which have been done i please protect me from the result of those sins this is the uh, meaning of the eighth verse the prose order is goes like this karunakara tvadeka rakshasya mama tvameva papani na pravartaya pravrtani nivartaya shrimate nirmanta mahadeshaya namaha